So for Tuesday, only a couple of weeks away, and you'll see some big changes when you go to cast your ballot this time, and that includes new voting centers and some new machines. And with all those changes comes the question how to make sure that what happened in Iowa doesn't happen right here. NBC4 iTeam has been working on that all day, and here to tell us their findings is Lolita Lopez. Yeah, no Lolita. question what happened in Iowa was just a mess, a worst-case scenario for those running the voting. Well, the process here in California isn't the same as Iowa, but officials here say they want to make sure we don't have any delays in our results. Election staffers in Orange County mailing off ballots, getting ready for Super Tuesday. Still almost a month away, and this year, big changes. It's new hardware and it's new software. It's a completely new system from top to bottom. Both isolated and protected, says Orange County Registrar of Voters, Neil Kelly. He tells the I-Team the OC will rely on paper ballots. Let's say there was a security breach or some other issue, I can go back to that original paper copy, and voters can know and have faith that that election can be reconstructed from scratch. In Iowa, officials are blaming the delay in results on a new app that they say had glitches in reporting the final counts from precincts, something that would not likely happen here. California law prohibits the transmission of results over wireless connections. What's specific in, in the law is that you cannot transmit the results, the precinct results from a polling place or a vote center to the central tabulation. Like in Orange County, Los Angeles County will have a voting window for Super Tuesday that has been expanded to 11 days, and you can also vote at various voting centers. Which means if we have some bumps along the way in those early days, we have some time to recover from that. L.A. County Registrar Recorder Dean Logan also rolling out these new touchscreen voting machines. The ballot marking device allows you to mark and review your selection and make any changes. Officials say the machines are not connected to the Internet and therefore cannot be hacked, and they actually won't report or store your vote. You'll get a paper ballot, and that's what's turned in and counted. Those ballots come back here to our office and will be tabulated um, on a central system that itself has been certified by the state. Yeah, and the new process in L.A. County is also heavily vetted by the Secretary of State, who just certified it last month. But he added conditions like having approved locks and tamper evidence seals on the machines themselves, including USB ports, and limiting passwords and secure access to only certain employees. Chuck?